Hi there, Gia. Hi, Keisha. Welcome to the exasperating show. I know. Oh, America, <laughs> if only you knew what we go through sometimes. With uh, the technology, yeah. The technology, and I don't think it's our fault this time. We seem to be losing audio for one of us at about yeah. a minute in, so we're going to keep our fingers crossed. And if Gia goes silent for a minute, then I'm going to will. Go. Everyone will go, hooray! <laughs> <laughs> and- the crowd rejoiced. There was much rejoicing. Oh, yeah. dear, dear. And, yeah, no, you're just going to no. sing a little song or I'm compose, gonna, a, yes, that's compose right. a ditty on the spot there. Yeah, or something. I'll, do some I'll do some scatting. I'll do some scatting. Yeah, just yeah. Just in honor of um, Marshall. Yep, yeah. Uh, Marshall's return. You know, well, and, we- and speaking of Marshall. Yep. Uh I, like, why does Curtis have to call him dad? Why can't he just call him Marshall? You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. It's, yeah. It stretches the limits. To- it really does. At his age, I don't think, you know, Marshall needs to be called dad. Like either, you know, I don't think Curtis, it seems like he could just call him Marshall for God's sake. It's just kind of weird and it makes me uncomfortable, but Marshall always makes me uncomfortable. Uh, are you still there, Gia, or have I lost you? I've lost you, haven't I? Okay. Well, while I while we have this moment, <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna talk a little bit about this old movie that was sort of a spoof of soap operas called Delirious. I don't know if you ever saw that movie, Gia. It was with John Candy. Also had some like real life soap opera actors in it, like Emma Sams, and it was very funny. There was one particular character. I think he was being poisoned. And uh, every time he saw him in a scene, his eyes looked like there were like there were purple rings around them and his teeth were gradually falling out. Um, And anyway, for some reason, hospital lately has been reminding me of that movie. So if you haven't seen it before, America and the world, you should check it out. Delirious. It's an old movie, but it was funny. Still no Gia? Gia? Anywhere? No, nothing. Uh, (laughs) Okay, T-shirts. I still have T-shirts, and we're still trying to figure out how to get some to our fans or our listeners, at least. Um, so perhaps what we'll do is um, set up a an email address, and then uh, we can ask listeners who are interested to send us a little email, and then it'll be sort of first come, first serve. Um, but I haven't got that worked out yet. We'll let you know next time we're, we're on the air. Um, still waiting for Gia to come back. I think it's this, it's, it's our app is betraying us. Um, Gia, anything? No. Can you hear me, Gia? Uh, I'm sitting with my kitty Barney, just waiting for Gia to come back. (laughs) Uh, And I think we're going to probably have to give up. Again. Okay. Okay. So now we're, okay. All right. All right. We're back America. We, these difficulties are really (laughs) bumming us out. (laughs) It's pretty silly, but you did a nice job there. That was a good filler, you know. Did you ever see that movie, Delirious? No, it sort of v- rings a vague bell, but yeah, um, yeah. Well, in the eighties or nineties? Yeah, probably, probably. Yeah. Um, I have to see. Maybe Hulu has it. We can look it up on Hulu. Hulu. Yeah, maybe, maybe Gia. Um, okay. So okay, so we're talking about Marshall and Curtis. Marshall and Curtis, and yeah, mm-hmm. and then also when they're out like the Hardy Boys. It, it was yeah. Like, uh, uh, yeah, that was super, super lame. It was very lame. And that conversation where they come upon uh, Portia and yeah. uh, interrupt her phone call. And he's yeah. like, Virgin, what? You know, it yeah. was all very, yeah. Yeah. like, just silly. And her yeah. sudden need to have somebody tell her about uh, schizophrenia and, you know, mm-hmm. grilling. I don't know. It yeah. was all very forced feeling. I wasn't. Mm-hmm. Uh, mm-hmm. Yeah, wasn't I know. It. it seems like the writing is very uneven because I would like to go back to some what I thought was good writing when Carly and Nina were sort of going toe to toe. You know, yeah, that was a good. That was a good scene. I thought. Um, yeah, I thought they both had good lines. They both sort of hit them. You know. Yep, and they both were, you know, 
I couldn't decide who I agreed more with. Yeah. I, kind of like, <laughs> yeah. I was like, okay, wow. Well, that was a huge gesture. But then it was like, Carly, oh, yeah. Like, how could yeah. Carly ever accept that? You know? Yeah. Yeah. I know. I thought, like, maybe she could have just accepted it, like, happily, like, without even a thank you and just sort of lived her best life. And maybe that would have been, like, a slap in the face to Nina. But, you know, Carly's not the type yeah. to do that. I don't know. And would Nina ever let her forget that she bought it for yeah, her? Yeah. Yeah. Carly yeah. was right. Especially yeah. I thought when, when she like her final argument that, you know, Nina bought it. So Sonny couldn't or something like that, you know? Yeah. Yeah. It was, yeah. It just wouldn't, it would never have worked, but um, yeah. But yeah, that was a pretty good scene. That was better mm-hmm. writing. I agree. Mm-hmm. Um Am I still here? I feel, yeah. I feel, I feel very <laughs> I fragile know. tonight. I not know. Knowing. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Will I be I... silenced? I may be <laughs> silenced at any moment. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Um, let's see. What else do we have? Oh, and then we had uh, a lot of Sasha and Brando. That, yeah. That and, yeah. And, uh, that, I don't know. That was okay. That was okay. But. Sasha Did you have the Amy, Amy Winehouse song playing in your head the whole time? <laughs> no, I didn't, thankfully. Um, okay. But uh, it seemed like Sasha was, it was a little st- silly that she thought, you know, anybody would believe that she was fine now, you know? Yeah, it, she'd had a hard couple days and then she's fine. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh, but I liked where they were headed when, I think that was the last we saw of them, when he, when Brando was saying, were you taking the pills when we got married. Yeah. Yeah. And it, it, it was, yeah. And it was like, she was so taking a lot of pills when they got married, you know, like yeah. when was she not taking them? You know, like, yeah. Yeah. Right. Uh, but, yeah. but I like that there's that little like tension between them now about that. That's a good, mm-hmm. yeah. Good thing yeah. to play out. Yeah. And he's not just blindly sort of accepting what she'll tell him. Yeah. Really at this point, you know, yeah. Um, so yeah, that was that was some movement, I guess. There. Um, and Gladys, it's always good to see Gladys. Yeah, and I, Gladys and, is being nice now, and I liked how yeah. that Sunny was. Sunny was sort of comforting her too. I, I thought. That yes, was nice. that was. We've really come a long way with Gladys. Yeah, <laughs> we have. I know. I never believed I would like Gladys. Yeah. Well, they had Once to like again. They've done. They it. had to calm her down from the initial yeah. like clown like um personality they gave her initially they had to yeah they had to yeah. allow her to have other sides other facets right. to her personality right. yeah um one thing that uh when sasha was asking like about the fallout i i kind of thought you know in soap opera land it could have just as easily been like a a sailing uh, like a sales boom you know when when she sort of had her meltdown, like it wouldn't destroy, you know, deception or That's anything. True. Yeah. You know, All that people would be good publicity. Yeah. yeah. So I, I don't know. And maybe we don't know yet really what the fallout is, but I don't know. I don't really see that being a big deal. Yeah. You know? it, although they could make it into a meme, like, like poor Brit. <laughs> you know, yeah, poor like Brit. That. And somehow like that, the consequences of that haven't been that bad for Brit, except for being embarrassed and humiliated, you know, but professionally, it doesn't seem like it's, it's had any. No, well, I hate to point this out, but in the real world, if you'd actually like (laughs) stolen a baby or whatever it was, I can't even remember what she did. (laughs) Yeah. (laughs) Are you, it's stolen. Oh, what did she do? She had somebody else's child or what did she do? I think so. I I think so. I was hoping we could get through one episode where we wouldn't wouldn't struggle to remember. Go, something. Yeah, I was like, what would yeah. she do? Did she steal Dante's semen or something and impregnate herself? <laughs> or I don't even remember. Am I making it worse than it was? Was it an embryo? I don't know. Like a oh, frozen an embryo. embryo. I, oh, I maybe that was it. it. But did she that. have the child? Did she carry the I child? I think so. I think so. Yeah. So normally that would take you out of the running for a sort of high level job. You think um, so? Hmm. I, I would hope so, but I'm not really <laughs> sure. Days. Yeah, yeah. I suppose you're right. Yeah, but uh, no, a little anyway. meme doesn't seem that bad. Like a no. GIF. I guess it's a GIF. It's, yeah, yeah, right. So yeah, okay. So we got a lot of different stuff happening in the last couple episodes um, involving a lot of different characters. 
Um, yeah, thank- thankfully we got we got a little less Cody. I feel like the last. Couple oh, days. that was good. Yeah, no Cody as far as I can little, remember. Really, the last Cody two days. Yeah, yeah, mm-hmm. that's always um, good. Let's but see. We Sunny did, said we did get all some in. True. We got some fucking uh, Drew and some Marshall. So you know. Yeah. Yeah. Six of one, half dozen of the other, huh? Yep. Um, we had uh, Sonny declare that he's all in with Nina. Yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> Something about that. Just I don't know what that means, really. But it didn't seem lovely <laughs> or sweet. I don't know. It just yeah. Kind of... And she was doing something weird with her eye, like kind of yeah. like <laughs> giving him the weird hairy eyeball with that squinty uh-huh. eye thing. He does. Uh-huh. Like I don't know. Yeah. I thought. It all feels a little bit labored or something like, is this mm-hmm. relationship doomed from the start? Probably. Probably. But, yeah. Yeah. And she like acted like somehow buying the Metro court was for them, like to help their relationship move forward, which yeah, that, like, what, what does that have to do with it? I don't know. So, yeah. Kind of a little convoluted. Yeah. Yeah. Suddenly it doesn't seem like they're quite in sync, you know? Yeah. Oh, sorry. I guess, <laughs> I guess it's the hour. Um, it's the hour, and I'm, I've got a lot of ben- Benadryl in my system. But oh my goodness, yeah, you do sound a little nasally, don't you? Sheesh. Um, yeah, I'm just trying to. I'm calming down. Uh, I think I'm having histamine reactions, oh. according to Google. I've been googling. A oh, lot. oh yeah. This is another thing, America, if you haven't figured this out already, Gia is really a masterful <laughs> diagnostician when it comes to her own ailments. I am. Right? If you only silence, people would listen. Yeah, you silence any doctor who tries to treat you. <laughs> Say, no, like, they I, eventually, do you, do you they tell eventually them you me asked down. your egg about all of these symptoms and you, you pretty much got it sorted out? You know, I you haven't. That's the one thing I, I haven't on done. I haven't asked the egg. I should ask the egg about it. But no, I came up with something about like maybe this fiber supplement is causing this eye ailment. And my husband was like, you know, looking at me like, what? I, you know, I'm like, well, some people have reactions. Oh, He's like, well, Rory. why would it be one eye? I'm like, what? Oh, Rory. <laughs> I don't know which one of you is luckier. <laughs> you are I don't know, but it, it's, I feel like, you know, I, sometimes I could be on a house episode, you know, like <laughs> yeah. you really dig deep there to find out what's you wrong really with you. Yeah. And usually it winds up being like a tick buried deep in like somebody's pubic hair or something. So I don't know. Check that too. Well, I'm sorry you went there with that. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I'm not lying. <laughs> I don't know if I've seen that episode, but that's <laughs> not least... what's happening with me, just FYI. Are you sure? <laughs> <laughs> Pretty sure. <laughs> that's, I feel like, uh, the tick thing, I'm glad to have le- left that behind in my movie. Yeah, I here. guess you don't have those. You might have, like, the Zika. Do they still have uh, We might Zika have the Zika virus? or whatever current yeah. pox is happening. Or yeah. Um, yeah, uh-huh. you know Z- Zika seems mild compared to the last couple of years. Like you know, yeah, that's Zika. <laughs> I don't think I'd want it though. Um, no, I wouldn't anyway. want it. But yeah, uh, so I'm anyway, sorry you're okay. struggling. I'm sorry you're struggling, Gia. Oh uh, no, I'm all right. But the Benadryl does make me a little snoozy. Um, yeah. Okay. Okay. What else mm-hmm. we got? Oh, so the big thing today was um, mm-hmm. preparing preparing trina for her right right Uh uh-huh uh oh a quick fashion shout out to both trina and joss who i thought yeah stunning in their in their courtroom outfits yeah that was a nice sort of old school dress trina had on didn't yeah yeah she could have been in an old movie yep Yep, yeah. and uh, I like Joss's little ensemble as well. So why yeah. do you think Scotty? I'd forgotten actually that Scotty was her lawyer, and then but then yeah. they, like now it's going to be um, Diane, Diane, which is certainly a good thing. Um, I don't know if something suddenly happened to old Scotty if he's got the COVID or something. I know, like I'm just wondering, like are people yeah. are they just cycling people out because they're suddenly like I'm on my summer vacation? <laughs> oh yeah, that's right, that's right, that's your that could happen for all of the the revolving door yeah could be yeah. that 
Yeah, yeah. Uh, but it, it was nice to see like all those strong women together, wasn't it? Like rooting for Trina, like all right, united. Right. Yeah. yeah. Um, they're gonna have to drag Taggart out of whatever closet they keep him in. Uh, <laughs> I know, I know. Yeah. And then at some point, do you think the trial will somehow have to reveal that Curtis is Trina's father, or is that like they seem to be pushing this whole like yeah. get the DNA to see if Trina's gonna be a schizophrenic? Yeah, yeah. Like, and then the pressure of the trial is gonna trigger something. Yeah, is trigger that like. Like that's not really how that works, is it? I don't think so. I, I that seems like a real stretch and and like sort of a cheap kind of way to you know create some drama, you know. Yeah. And, and yeah. for a young woman that we've been watching for a couple of years yeah, here, who's solid who's shown as a rock. no, yeah, no signs of any sort of mental illness or yeah. she might be the only uh, character who hasn't. <laughs> right, the only one that yeah. doesn't need a little stay in the Shady Brook uh, <laughs> yeah. rec room or whatever. Yeah, um, yeah. So, and you'd think that Portia, being a doctor herself, would mm -hmm. would know a lot more about this already and not be asking inane <laughs> questions. Yeah, you would think so. Like, yeah, I guess maybe she. I mean, I know she's supposed to be like an obstetrician or something, but maybe she's what, I don't cut some what she crucial is. classes. I don't know. Maybe. Um, yeah. But, you know, and it, keeping this secret, like Portia acts like she's this like real solid, you know, citizen and keeping that from Curtis, that that would be enough to just destroy the relationship, don't you think? You would think so, but I would think just having Marshall around all the time would put a kibosh on it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Good point. Dad, I know. Everybody calling him Grampy oh and Dad. Oh, my God. Yeah, what a weird household that is. <laughs> yeah. Do they yeah. always have, like, just jazz playing in the background? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Little finger snapping. Jazz yeah, cat. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's just awful. Yeah. yeah. Awful. Um, yeah. Oh, another thing I noticed, this is my favorite part of today. When okay. Marshall and Curtis find the, the bartender that's dealing in the, the hot. <laughs> yeah. Bones, yeah. Uh -huh. Did you notice his bedspread in his little room? <laughs> I noticed the plants. I thought, I thought. Oh, and I didn't notice the plants, but I was taken with the bedspread. It had this yeah. like sort of nautical, it had like uh -huh. sailboats all over yeah. it. Yeah. I, I thought seemed you'd really very... like it. Well, the edges seemed very sharp, like it wasn't actually a mattress under there. Yeah, I couldn't quite figure out what I was looking at. Yeah, initially. <laughs> I was like, what is that? But I think it was supposed to be the bed, yeah. Yeah, yeah. But, yeah, it was. But, but it you know, was... he's a criminal. They ha don't have good bed. <laughs> well, you wouldn't think they'd have plants either. I, I wasn't sure if it was like a like a motel or something where he was staying. A flop house. Yeah. A flop. So but they've got it's... a lot of seedy characters going yeah, on. Yeah, they, 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 it seems like it's not a problem for them to find people to play these seedy characters. The link and, and look, yeah. Look apart, you know? Dex or Dax or whatever he is. Dex, He's a little uh, seedy. Yeah, he is. Yeah. Yeah. He looks cool. Did you like that little, like, conversation between he and Brando? The, like, <laughs> yeah, man, I, where were you? Where, you know, yeah, man. Yeah, where, you know. yeah. I wasn't sure what that was meant to be accomplishing. Like, is it supposed to make Brando sort of less suspicious of him? Or more suspicious of him. Or more, or make Dex less likely to, like, betray Brando, like, because he's connected to Sonny. I don't know. I, well, I, don't I, know. Thought, I thought maybe they were trying to make us, the viewers, have mm -hmm. a little more connection to Dex. Dex? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I guess. Yeah. Um, you know, like give him a little more of a backstory so we Right, you know, right, yeah. I don't know. Make him more of a person. Yeah, but he just always sounds like a tool when, you know, he's talking to Sonny. Just like Yeah. Know. Yeah. And Sonny sounds uh, like a tool when he's talking to him too. Like, yeah, he does. Know. Yeah. Yeah. I don't think we need to see any of that. <laughs> I also noticed I don't know why I noticed this, but when mm -hmm. Dex asked Brando if he wanted coffee, Brando just said no. Like <laughs> He didn't Did say like upset you. <laughs> no thanks. Yeah. But I yeah. thought is that supposed to be menacing or something or like is, I, I wasn't sure. Uh -huh. It just seemed a little weird. Yeah, like weird I thought. Moment. I thought was he thinking that Dex might poison him or something? I don't <laughs> or know. all of his 
waiting yeah. to be poisoned yet. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. I never yeah. taken a beverage from anybody else. Po- poisoning or, or you know, trying mm-hmm. to kill somebody. We had the the, mm-hmm. uh, the next Valentine and Laura, you know. Yeah. Like, mm-hmm. oh, I'm so clumsy and, you know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> didn't mean to manhandle you. <laughs> it's funny. <laughs> 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 she must be like, what the fuck? <laughs> it's like he's, you know, like thinking of like, and he he made the it was a good cover to say. Ever since I've you know come out of that yeah. uh, hospital or whatever, I don't uh-huh. remember what he was supposed to have had some infection yeah. or something. Like. He should affect <laughs> this new like spastic, <laughs> you know, like, like a like a Jerry <laughs> Lewis kind of character. Yeah, yeah, like suddenly. <laughs> Fallen into people and stuff, and <laughs> throwing things and unexpected muscle spasms and yeah, whatever. yeah. He could kind cover of like a lot. Spencer's arms. He could do the arms. Yeah, flailing with the some. arms. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh, that's a good idea, Gia. That yeah, would, that was kind of funny. That's yeah, that's a solid idea. I hope they're taking notes tonight. Yeah, yeah, I hope so. But uh, yeah. anyway. You know, it, I had forgotten that Trina was sitting on that piece of information that she was with Spencer outside. I totally, yeah, that was, I was like, what are they talking about? I know, it's like, they're going to make something up and expect us to believe it. (laughs) (laughs) But I still don't get how, I mean, I know they, she pointed out that, she, she wouldn't need to have been present to be the one. Right. Who right. The yeah. Yeah, definitely. Um, so yeah. I don't know how important that information really is. Yeah. Um, it might cause more harm than good, I guess. But like uh, Josh said, it would maybe help with the reasonable doubt thing. Yeah. Yeah. So Although it makes out. Trina look a little bit, you know, slippery because she was out with a guy who was supposed to be in prison and she didn't tell anybody. So, yeah. And, the, and Jordan came along right during it. And uh, yeah, so, right. Yeah. Didn't say anything. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Hmm. yeah. I interesting. don't know. Interesting. So, interesting. Oh. Yeah. And it seemed a little, uh, a little of a, a bit of a stretch that the, the phone salesman would go to Windermere <laughs> to confront Esme. Doesn't that seem a little odd? Yeah. It seems like everybody's coming and going from Windermere so easily. Yeah. And I thought yeah. it was something that involved, you know, the boat launch. Yeah. And kind of a, a bit of a weight and you right. know, it's like, it's, oh, yeah, I'll go yeah. catch that necklace. You know, it's like, what? You're going to go I all know. the way back to. Yeah. Island? Yeah. That's how much she loves Trina. I mean, I know they've got that new sandwich board with a boat advertisement. Right. right. And, yeah. You know, maybe mm-hmm. travel is easier now. <laughs> maybe now that people know where the dock is. Maybe there's a launch like every 15 minutes or something, but maybe. it seems, yeah, that yeah. seemed a little. Maybe they're just regretting having them be on Spoon Island where it's like really far. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh-huh. Could and they be. never seem to know where they're always asking like, oh, is Spencer here? Like, no, like they can't keep track of each other out there. No, they really can't. They really can't. They should ask the guy who drives the boat back and forth. You probably know yeah. where he is. Um, also, remember when um, Spencer, well, he was, of course, mean to Britt, but when he had her uh investigate what those pills were that he found yeah and shouldn't he have done something with that information yeah that's a a much more viable piece of information than this whole yeah cockamamie scheme to find (laughs) pretend to find esme's mother yeah Uh uh-huh which i don't (laughs) even like that's so twisted it's so convoluted yeah, it's just silly also. Unless I'm really missing something. Uh, I know. I think maybe it's a, it's what it's going to reveal instead that's going to be the, I don't know, the, the interesting part of that. I don't know. Like that, that Felicia is her actual mother? Well, didn't he take DNA from um, Joss and Carly? Joss and, yeah, Joss and Carly, right. Because he's just pretending. Yeah. He just wanted... Right, right. Wanted but what match. if it turns yeah. out that Joss somehow isn't... Well, of course she's related to Carly, but maybe the, would the father... The father wouldn't be anybody that could figure out from the DNA test. I don't know, Gia. I don't know. Mm, that was a good flounder, though. Um, Thanks. <laughs> yeah. So I was like, wait, her father? 
Wait, Knox would be related to her. Wait, wait, what? Wait. Uh, I know, I know. I think um, I'm, I'm seeing too many like theories putting being put forth by like some of these fan pages. You know, maybe it would be like the blood type would be wrong or something, and something like, like yeah. that. Yeah, I don't yeah. know. I don't know, but hmm. Spencer, mm -hmm. yeah. So Jax is Joss's dad. Yeah, yeah, and I don't think we're supposed to have any doubt about that. But, yeah, or that Carly's her mom. There couldn't right. be any doubt about that either, right? So, right. Yeah. Huh. Do, oh, wait, wait. Uh, <laughs> is is the doctor in you kicking in? No, I. But I'm having a moment. Uh, <laughs> what sort Nell, of wait? Nell is pick? supposed to be. Nell is supposed to be. Oh no, that's Willow. That's Willow. I was yeah, suddenly. Willow. Wait a second. Joss has somebody's. Joss has Nell's kidney. Is that what it is? Jo yes. Joss has Nell's kidney. Does that have anything to do? No. I just thought mm -hmm. would that somehow well, are Nell and. No, that's what I was going like. Are oh, Nell and oh, I see. <laughs> Nell and Willow are supposed Nell to be. Nell and Willow. Nell and Willow. Okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Jesus. What have I they done to us, Gia? <laughs> I, don't I don't think we can blame them. But I just had that sudden moment like, could that yeah, have yeah. anything to do with yeah. the DNA being. I don't know. I just. <laughs> wow. Talk about Maybe we shouldn't yeah. release this episode. <laughs> The gods were trying to prevent it from happening, and yeah, oh boy! But that oh reminded boy. me of when I was talking about the movie Delirious before. I was trying to think why, what well, you became that Delirious. Yeah. Um, it was when when Chase was like very deathly ill because he'd been poisoned, and he was looking all like you know, like oh yeah, and they like they, they really. Stuff. That's what reminded me of that. That movie. Yeah, well, and Willow recently too, when they oh, had yeah, her. Yeah, 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 right, yeah. So it's a it's a great friend. classic sort of soap opera, you know. Yeah, yeah, yep. yeah. Uh, but anyway, yeah. So we haven't had any real developments with the Willow Nina situation. Carly's just sitting on that information. Right, right. We and thought, we know that there'll be some crisis with the pregnancy yeah, that will yeah. cause that information mm -hmm. to have to come out. Carly will have to reveal it. Yeah, yeah, uh-huh. And then it'll be like, aha, we're even. I kept something from you. You kept something from me. Yeah, yeah. That kind of thing. I don't know. Right, right, uh-huh. Yeah, and, that'll be interesting. And I don't know. Eventually, they'll probably be best friends. <laughs> Carly and, and Nina? Yeah, maybe when Nina gets tired of Sunny and... They'll come yeah. close to people and they'll be like, God, yeah. where did we see that guy or something like that? You know? Uh huh. Yeah. Well, it yeah. does, it is starting to become, and I guess we knew this long, a long time ago, that you take them out of Nixon Falls and all the real world kind of, you know, stuff. But yeah. It's like the snow, the snow globe. Yeah. The snow globe has been busted. Right, right. Yeah. yeah. They're not yeah. one of those Hallmark movies anymore. Yeah, and is speaking of which, isn't Drew supposed to be off making a Hallmark movie pretty soon? When's that oh, happening? You know, uh, <laughs> when is that happening? <laughs> Hopefully around. And can you take Cody with I, him? Yeah, <laughs> I know that would be great. Uh, yeah, um, I don't know, Gia, but I didn't like it in that brief scene that he had when he was talking to uh, Olivia. Um, and then Sonny came in and, and Drew yeah, was talking, they were talking about, about like, business crap, you know, it's like, you just sound like an asshole, you know? <laughs> um, but I did love Olivia's dress, actually. I'm going to give another yes, that, shout that out there. A, yeah, yeah, that was a nice little number on her. Of course, you know, what, what couldn't she wear? Well, you know? sure, sure, right. Sure. Yeah, but she looked real good. And I, I also liked uh, how she was like kind of standing by Ned, even though she didn't really agree with him. Yeah, yeah, that's mm -hmm. nice. Yeah, that was solid. Yeah, yeah, and I don't know why you should have to like blindly just like you know do the quarter main way, you know. Wait, Instead. you mean why should she do the quarter main way? 
no, why should Ned have been expected to just, you know? Oh, move, oh, yeah, move, yeah. Like, you know, just yeah. like block. I don't know. Right. Yeah. And Valentin had a point. He did. He, you know, ELQ was profitable when he was running it. So, you know. Yeah. And, um, and it was, you know, everybody wanted to see Michael and Drew taken down a pig and, and uh, yeah. Yeah. that was a good way to do it. So mm -hmm. yeah, everybody wins. everybody wins. And in some ways it <laughs> seems like they should be a little more kind to Valentin because he was a wonderful dad with Bailey, you know, that's true. And he lived under their roof for all that time. And yeah. 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 So I don't know. It was kind of family in a way, a little bit. Yeah. Yeah. Sort of. Brooklyn should be a little more understanding of him or sympathetic towards him, I think. Yeah. That would have been fun if they'd made them kind of be a, a little more of a couple. Yeah. Know, and, then yeah. To, and then have to break away from that. Mm hmm. Uh, because mm -hmm. I thought they had fun chemistry together. Yeah, I don't know. he's good with every every you know he he has chemistry with every uh, woman you put him with. It seems like. Mm -hmm. Yeah, especially so, if they've got some sass, you know. Yeah, believable. You know, I find yeah. it pretty believable. Um, yep, he's not a character I never thought I'd like. So once except again, except when he's playing a French sailor seducing <laughs> Jennifer Smith. Yeah, yeah. And and really, like if Laura had been taken out by a sniper <laughs> like that, that was a smart way to go. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, anyway, well, I look forward to their next scene. What 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 will he have to do next? <laughs> <laughs> He'll probably like push her off the pier. <laughs> yeah, throw her off a parapet or something. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'd like to see the conversation she's having with Kevin. Like, is yeah, she... trying to explain the latest. Like, <laughs> Valentine's <laughs> gone nuts. <laughs> I think he has a crush on me. <laughs> He's trying to touch me all the time. <laughs> <laughs> and Kevin did see the first instance, so you know he would. Know right, yeah, not yeah. lying. They'll yeah. figure it out. They're smart, though, and he they did say, kind of like he emphasized, you know, like he would do anything for Charlotte, right. anything, yeah. like he was trying to tell her something. So, yeah, and Laura had it broken down to two reasons why he would be behaving that way, and she was very close, you know. Yeah. Yep. yep. So. Yeah, she's she's the one person who could figure this out. Yeah, she should be the spy, not like Anna. And yeah, they're yeah. they're clowns compared to her. Yep, none of the detectives or anything can measure yeah. up. Lasha yeah, really can't. Yeah, she's she's the goods. Yep. Um, oh, well, have we covered things? I don't know. Um, Very lackluster this evening. I apologize. Yeah, well, you know, we had like six false starts. I know. We were beaten down by the technology. <laughs> the technology is, yeah. But uh, I guess we've covered it, Gia. Yeah, it was just two days, so there wasn't really yeah. much. You know. Yeah. So now we'll be in the courtroom again. Now we'll be in the courtroom. Yeah. And um, who knows? Maybe Spencer will come up with something, or you know, Marshall will pull something out of his tiny hat. Tiny hat. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. They'll the phone thing. They'll bring the guy. I don't know. I don't know how. Who's gonna save save the day? Yeah. Um, yeah. Hmm. But uh, it'll it'll happen. Think. Yeah, yeah. I'd like it to be Ava. You know, I think it would be great. That, yeah, that would be nice. It's, Ava's been her, on her side, like from grab Ava. that guy by the ear and drag him back back to the court. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So we we'll look okay. forward to that. Well, right, let's, yeah. let's put a lid on this and and uh, <laughs> if you lasted this long, listener. Thank you. Yeah, so much. listener. Yeah, I think we can. <laughs> the listener, yeah. Assume it's they're just like, one person. They're like, oh <laughs> my God. Do we have to prove that we've listened to get a t shirt? <laughs> yeah, we should have some some code word buried <laughs> yeah. in the middle of the episode. Yeah, they have you gotta listen to all the way to the end to see, yeah. <laughs> oh, that would be Ooh. so mean. Okay. That would be well, so mean. That'd be fun to work on something though, you know. And then yeah. it'll it'll be something like you have to know that we said, you know, sparkle pony or something like that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and I hope you know, America, I would not be the one to say that. Those two words would not come out of my mouth. They would 
come out of that Benadryl. <laughs> yeah, but you're the one that's talking about ticks and people's nether yeah. regions. You know, but, uh, yeah. I'm hoping like, that yeah. when we wrap up here that you will do a tick check. <laughs> And then we'll get the results next time. <laughs> okay. And then the, question will be, the, the T-shirt question will be, okay, America, what was so Gia weird. supposed to do over the weekend? <laughs> oh. Okay, well, now we really are going to go because you're getting just weird. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. All right. Okay, well, yeah. thanks, everybody. And let's talk right. about General Hospital in a few days. Yeah, and I hope you feel better, Gia. Oh, thank you, ma'am. Okay. Okay. Say hi to Rory. Okay. Okay.